What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Admiral back again with another video today. We're on another gym vlog, but today is my supposedly legs day, right? But I'm not gonna do legs because I'm feeling tired on my legs, um, my hamstrings especially. They feel a little bit of tense and like I'm um, overworked. I, I can feel it, I can feel it. I think I've been cycling a lot here and there. You all know the annual app, right? So they allow you to rent a bicycle and I'm, I've been cycling around my neighborhood just for fun going around places and traveling, you know? But yeah, I've been, I've been going around my neighborhood on the bicycle and at a very fast speed. Like if I go past you on bicycle, you would think that it was a flash. You know what I mean? Because I am, I am speed on bicycle. But anyways guys, I'll be skipping legs day today. I know right, you're skipping legs day like what? It's 2023. People see the skip legs day. If, I mean if you're not feeling 100% right, yeah. That doesn't give you any reason to go and do it. So you're overtraining and you might not even grow and you might even injure yourself on top of that. So. Like chill, I can do it the next week whatsoever, no problem at all, I'll be skipping shoulders <laughs> I'll be skipping legs and be doing shoulders today, that's what I meant Okay, so I'm getting in a little bit of chlorine slushy in I add a little bit more water to make it more um, watery and not so ice creamy because Ah, oh, delicious I want to quickly get it down and head to the gym because I spent half my day uh, editing a video that you just watched previously Or maybe the last two videos, I don't know but yeah, I spent a lot of time editing it and right now I'm gonna head to the gym before I end the day off because the longer I take to go to the gym, right, the later I'll finish and you know, it just adds up. I wanna get it done and get it over with and then get on to my schoolwork because I have a report due next week. I wanna start doing it. Well, actually, I started doing it, but it's not done. It's like one quarter, two fifth way done ish. I'm still not done with the report, but I still wanna get my workout in and you know, start recording for YouTube and stuff. So, you know, you gotta, you gotta make time to make better time. What am I saying? You gotta give and take sacrifice is needed for the optimal growth of a person. So anyways guys, gonna finish this protein slushy up and then we're here to upgrade hitting shoulders today. I might, I might hit a little bit of biceps but I did that yesterday so... No, let's, let's just hit a normal shoulder workout and do some cardio after that. Yeah, let's get it. All I ever wanted was to see you smiling. All I ever wanted was to make you mine. I know that I love you. Oh, baby, why don't you see that all I ever wanted was you and me? All I ever wanted was to see you smiling. All I ever wanted was to make you guys, so um, shoulders, right? I think it's not a bad thing to do shoulder presses. But it's just I feel that it's not the most optimal way to grow your shoulders. You focus on these other two exercises, which are your laterals and your rear delt flies. So you don't need to overtrain the front part of your shoulders. You want to get the 3D delt, side delt, back delt, rear delt, whatever you call it. But I'm still doing it because you know you love the feeling of shoulder pressing. It's, it's like you can go heavy and do this. Everybody loves doing it, right? So let's just do some shoulder presses. Okay guys, the last exercise for shoulders, I would say I like to do a superset. So like I said the two most important is the side and rear delt. So for the last exercise, we'll do a superset of the laterals and then the rear delts and finish it off. It's to really tie up that muscle and then you just end it with rear delts to give it that extra juicy pump, you know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm doing right now. Go lighter on this and then just do the failure on the laterals. And finally finish off with your rear delt raises. Um, let me show you, okay? We are back home about to cook up a post. Let me turn on the fan. 
Now you can hear me better. We're about to cook up a post workout meal. You have C, you have C, you have with me. What am I saying? With me today, you have some canned tuna, Greek yogurt, and tomatoes, chili, onions. We're about to cook up a very simple dish. It's, it's a really nutritious, it's very high in protein, it's very cheap as well. Okay, it's just basically tuna sandwiches. And also, don't forget your main ingredient. We got some bread. So, I chopped up these bad boys and we just need to fry them later. Put some tuna in it and then when it's cold, put some yogurt in it and then spread it on bread. Easy as one, two, three. Let's get cooking, baby. taste test again of this tuna sandwich that I made okay one more time one taste test it looks so beautiful but I don't want to eat it I want to preserve it but I'm hungry I'm gonna eat it delicious OMG baby mm. super high in board super low in protein guys <laughs> super low in calories high in Protein. Go and try out this tuna recipe. It's delicious. It's easy to make. It's cheap. I don't see a reason why you shouldn't try it. Okay. So I'm gonna page this up and go and wrap up the video. The wrong bite. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. Thank you for watching today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did vlogging. And until next time, remember to follow your dreams. I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.